coming in fresh at number eight we have Mr. Eldridge from Dark Season. Now a lot of people might not know who Mr. Eldridge was or in fact heard of Dark Season but you will have heard of the guy who did Dark Season who was a little known guy at the time called Russell T Davis. Who knew right? And it was kind of set in this school, had a kind of buffy vibe, had these three kids get into all kinds of shenanigans as kids seem to do. Um, and the main villain that they were up against was this guy called Mr. Eldridge. And uh, he kind of looked like Spike out of Buffy. Uh, and he kind of had sort of Spike peroxide blonde hair and he always wore sort of sunglasses and stuff. And this guy was proper creepy. If you see the show, you know what I'm talking about. The reason I've picked this guy was he had no plan. Right? He was just doing all this stuff for like, for giggles. He, he just didn't care. There's this really great speech that he gives where, um, you know, he's trying to control the world and he kind of says, I want no part of control. I will draw together the reins of power only to scatter them. Chaos. Sweet, eternal chaos. Now, if that isn't scary, I don't know what is. So that's why he's my pick. Also, as well, the dude wore sunglasses and looked a little bit like Billy Idol. I don't know what the hell was about. At number seven, it's Richmond Valentine from the Kingsman Secret Service, a classic supervillain. Valentine is a hilariously squeamish technology tycoon who plans to destroy the human race, save for a small party of VIPs. By using specially controlled SIM cards, Valentine is able to send mankind into a violent frenzy at the touch of a button, leaving him and his crew to bask in an abundance of luxury and space. Or so he hopes. 